My friends, in Psalm 92, there's a very important and helpful message. The psalmist, in fact, was speaking as if he were. The Lord's loudspeaker speaks to your heart and mind. My eye also has seen my desire on my enemies. Would you like the enemy not to attack you? Your eyes, your spiritual perception will see that in God's word. My ears hear my desire of those who rise up against me of the wicked ones. It's also necessary to surrender to the word of God, to believe in what the Bible declares in order for us to be successful. We'll pray in a minute, but before that, watch this person who was blessed. I had cancer in my bones eight years ago, and I was confined to a bed for five years, and I watched Grace TV a lot. The first time you came to town, I came here, the second time as well, now it's the third, and I'm here to seek my complete blessing. And now, couldn't you do this? Yes, and this region was so painful. You had chest pain? Yes. And could you raise your knee? No, no. How were you walking before? I was using a cane for support, even inside my house, and I didn't go out So walk normally now. Oh, look at that. And she can even walk briskly. Let's pray. I pray for everyone. I cry out to you in their favor. I ask you for your help. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, there's no way evil can touch their life now or ours. I bend all evil forces. I cast them out by saying, let go of these people. Be gone now in the name of Jesus. And you say, thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. 